The group is planning on having a demonstration this Saturday at the Centennial Fountain in Bricktown. Now, organizers tell me it's going to take community involvement in order to prevent more children from becoming victims. They say it's happening from coast to coast and here in Oklahoma. A lot of them get traveled through here. We are at the crossroads of what they say, you know, one of the worst places for human trafficking because we've got the, you know, the, the I-40 corridor. And Alyssa Hutton is representing Freedom for the Children Oklahoma, a local nonprofit holding a demonstration this Saturday to raise awareness about child sex trafficking. A lot of people think it's, you know, people getting kidnapped and taken overseas, but really, you know, it can happen in our backyard. People can hold their boyfriends or girlfriends, you know, and traffic them right here. People traffic their children. She tells me the march is also a chance to educate those in the community about looking out for the signs to prevent more children from becoming victims. So we need to look for the signs. We can't just be, I need to mind my own business because there are people out here that are mothers and fathers that are for drugs selling selling their children. And that's one of the things that, that we're marching for and rallying for is that we can get people aware of not only the signs, but what to do if you see it and to get involved early before people can become victims. On our KOCO 5 app, we'll have more information on Saturday's demonstration. Paris Jones, KOCO 5 News.